Okay guys, so for cleaning the land, basically only thing you need is some cotton pads, uh, the lens holder, the air blower and the top all too. If you were used to use some uh, propanol or acetone, just forget about it. You are not gonna use it. We will do the cleaning of the land just with the top all too. So basically the procedure is you take a holder, you take a lens. That's up to you. You can start with uh, concave or convex side. So let's start with the with the convex side. That's the side which has the shape like a U. Okay, now take one cotton pad. As first, use some air and just blow all the dust away. Grab your top hole too, shake it well. If you have some uh, top hole already on the, on the cup, just wipe it down. Because once you close the bottle again and then open it, all this liquid will become uh, dust during the time and you will just have the dust everywhere. So, before closing your Topol 2 bottle, just wipe it down. It will save you some time for next time so yeah, why don't do that right away right yeah so we shake it well top all two we blow all the dust from the lens away now take the cotton pad open it so you know that whatever inside is very clean and it will not scratch uh, the lens okay Use just a little bit, like two drops, and then like tap it on the lens until it cover a whole surface of the side which you started. Now grab the lens with your two fingers and with circle motion use a little pressure and with circle motion clean the lens. Okay. If you have uh, the topol, if after the cleaning, if it's uh, with some color like a yellowish or orange, just uh, probably you would need to clean it twice. If it stays clean, so we are okay, and just clean it once it's again. Use the air blower again and blow some air on the topol. It will become dry faster. Okay, now. Use the other cotton pad, open it, grab your lens and with gentle motion, with gentle motion side to side, clean the top all. Okay, place the lens back. Blow the air again. Open another side, another cotton, cotton pad, and with straight motion, one direction, use a little bit harder, uh, bigger pressure, and just swipe whatever top or left on the lens. Uh, during the cleaning, you can have some uh, topol on the side of the lens, so you can clean it as well. Yeah, and the lens is super clean. There is no scratch, nothing, and that's it. We are not gonna use any. We will not use any acetone or or propanol. Now we just clean it with the top hole too, 
we wipe it, as we wipe it, it like we polish it, and now the lens is super clean without any scratch. Yeah, so I would say that the the main the the main procedure, I mean the activity is to blow the dust away. Yeah. So let's make the other side. So blow the air. Open one cotton pad. Use a little bit of topol. Tap, tap, tap. Like this. Hold the lens with your two fingers. And with circle motion, polish and clean the surface. With the air blower, air some, blow some air and make the topol dry faster. Open another cotton pad with gentle, with gentle motion. Clean the dry topol. Like this. Blow the air. Just blow away all the dry top wall which left on the surface. Open the another cotton pad. And now with a um, little, little bit bigger pressure and straight, I mean one direction motion. Clean the surface. If you are not sure, you can do it twice. Blow the air. Always use, always use a new cotton pad. Don't, don't swipe it twice with the old, uh, with the old cotton pad. Okay, you can flip the lens. Blow the air. Yeah, so and that's it. Uh, some little, you know, uh, pieces from the cotton pad left on the on the lens. So blow the air again. Yeah, and that's it. The lens is super clean, shiny, without any scratch. So, okay. Thanks for watching. And I just uh, one more thing I wanted to say. If you work with the lens, you should be wearing some, some gloves or some finger protectors because the grease and sweat from your hands, it can cause some damage on the lens. Otherwise, the lens itself, it's, it's, um, it's safe, right? So the only reason is uh, that you can hurt, you can, you can do some damage on the lens if uh, you have some dirt on your fingers. So unfortunately, I don't have the gloves. So I did it without, but usually I wear them. Yeah, so just keep on mind. Okay, so, uh, and before closing the topol too, just make sure that uh, there isn't any topol on it, on the cup, because once you close it, so if you will open it after a week or two, so if you will open it, it will stay clean. And if you would close it with the topol on it, then the topol will become a dust during the time and it's just a mess. So keep your stuff clean. Thanks for watching. 
Okay guys, thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope you like it and it was useful for you. If you have any questions or comments, please write them below this video into the comment section. And see you later. Take care.